Well, yesterday the Modi government bowed down to pressure from the Supreme Court had submitted the names of 627 foreign account holders. Now, this has raised worries about India's commitment to the confidentiality clause in various tax treaties. Now, we learn that India has deferred signing a multilateral information sharing agreement. Now, Priyal is joining us with more on how India seems to have been caught in the crossfire as far as the issue of unearthing the black money trail is concerned. Well, absolutely. Uh, essentially, the big issue really that is uh, going to come forward is with regard to the confidentiality clause of various uh, DTAs that India has signed and with almost over 70 countries with which India has signed those agreements. But more importantly, uh, in the recent uh, of events, uh, which is as early as yesterday, where the OECD meeting took place in uh, Berlin, where, the, uh, where the India could not or had to defer the signing of uh, the agreement which was an enabler to ensure that the top countries or uh, regions across the across the globe are able to sa uh, share information as far as the tax is issue is concerned and overall on uh, sort of uh, having uh, a common platform in terms of addressing the tax evasion issues were concerned but uh, and that primarily because uh, the commitment that the government cannot make at this point in time as far as the confidentiality is concerned. Remember, the Supreme Court, after asking the government to share or disclose all the names uh, with uh, the Supreme Court, which of course has now been handed over to the SIT for investigation, there remains a grey area until the SIT report in November, which is scheduled uh, to come up, as to what happens way forward as far as the disclosure of the names that have been the list that has been provided, what happens thereafter. Remember, as per the confidentiality clause, unless and until they, the investigations prove any illegality, uh, there is a restriction in terms of sharing of the information that the countries are passing on to each other. More importantly, most tax uh, uh, experts point out that, uh, that uh, the Supreme Court itself in earlier 2011 judgment had stressed on right to privacy and therefore non-disclosure. But given the situation and the way it has unfolded in the last few days in the black money case raises a, a shadow on uh, India's stance uh, as far as whether it will be able to commit to non-disclosure norms required in all these DTAs. Thank you.